Every cattleman appreciates cattle that have been taught to handle well. Most properties apply low stress cattle handling techniques and train their staff in these methods. Big improvements have been made in yard design and cattle flow. We would like the opportunity in this video to demonstrate to you cattle being processed and handled through a silencer hydraulic cattle crush. Processing cattle has just got a whole lot easier. We'll guarantee to show you while processing cattle through a silencer that you can seriously reduce your labour costs, reduce the number of labour you require, reduce the time you spend processing cattle, reduce stress and bruising on your cattle, and reduce the number of staff injuries. The operator here is preg testing cows in a silencer crush. He has the controls of the silencer on the pivot arm directly in front of him. This allows him to operate the crush while preg testing and bang tailing at the same time. In most facilities, what is being done here is often a two man and sometimes even a three man operation. Here, over 200 cows per hour are being processed comfortably and efficiently. The black louvers on the side of the silencer assist with the animal's flight zone. The animal has only a clear forward view and is not balked by people at the side of the crush. As the operator makes the catch, it is important that at the same time, the upper squeeze is applied. The animal is now not only being caught by the neck, it is also being caught and held by its body. This prevents the animal from pulling back, fighting, struggling and bruising itself. Once the catch is made, the neck can be hydraulically extended to increase neck access. Additional access to the neck in front of the shoulder is also an option and the animal cannot move about. Now, because we've gained control of the body, we have complete control of the head. Simply by using the controls, we can turn the head left or right, making it much easier to do whatever we need to at the head of the animal. The animal cannot fight and knock itself about. Our staff are safe, meaning less injuries occurring, and the animal is not stressed. The important point to understand here, and which is totally overlooked in every other crush, is that the only way you can gain total control of the head is by first gaining control of the animal's body. The release of the animal is just as important as the catch. To release the animal in a silencer, we first open the head doors. At this stage, we still have control of the body and the animal has a moment to realise the way out and starts to lean forward. At the same time, we open the back doors so the next animal can see its mate leaving and will follow forward. We then release the squeeze on the animal and it walks out steadily. This all adds to the smooth, steady flow of cattle. The lower squeeze is set to the size animals being processed. This is perhaps a little narrower than you would expect. The reason for this is when an animal enters the crush, it has to then place its feet to keep its balance, which steadies the animal up and creates a smooth flow. The lower squeeze also prevents an animal from going down. When it is entering the crush and is showing a tendency to lie down, the operator simply squeezes the lower squeeze a little more, which prevents this happening. You need to consider the experience the animal has in the crush and what have you just taught it? If the animal is stressed, fighting and the crush is making a lot of noise, it only stands to reason the animal will behave badly the next time around. An important feature of the silencer is there is no steel on steel anywhere. All contact points are sheathed in a high density polyethylene material. This virtually eliminates the steel on steel chatter of other crushes, guaranteeing a quiet crush over its working life. The drop down bars along the side of the crush provide plenty of easy access. The drop down pans either side provide easy access for bull testing or treating problem feet. A good additional feature is the emergency side exit gate. With the controls mounted on the pivot arm, this allows the operator to be part of the processing crew while tagging or vaccinating and also reduces labour. 
whatever the position the operator stands in with the controls, is able to see an animal as it enters the crush and all the way forward to make the catch. Notice here while preg testing that no kick gate is used at all. Kick gates can be compared to giant rat traps, which are the cause of many injuries. With correct control of the upper squeeze, an animal cannot flex sideways or lunge forward or back. It is safe and easy to come from the side, making it unnecessary in most cases from getting directly behind the animal. This also reduces a lot of effort. If access behind the cow is necessary, an additional optional feature are the hydraulic kick bars. There is no risk of a kick gate being kicked back or letting go and causing injuries. Silencer comes in different models to suit your operation. These can be standard length, as shown here, or an extended length, which are more suited to stud operations, who sometimes require more room behind the cow when performing AI and embryo transfer procedures. Scales can be fitted under the silencer crush. Overhead scales are another option. These come with two heavy-duty load cells mounted above the silencer. When cattle are being processed but not weighed, the crush can be hydraulically lowered to rest on the ground, so then no unnecessary stress is placed on the load cells. The crush can then be lifted into place for weighing and then lifted higher for an easy clean-out underneath. With the standard length silencer, two portable trailer options are available, which allow the crush to be moved and used in multiple sets of yards. The yoke trailer shown here can be used for both on and off-road use. The carry-all trailer is for off-road use only. Rob and his wife Sarah now run an intensive breeding and finishing operation near Jinjin in central Queensland. He has embraced some very innovative technology to run his own cattle property. What's really important in our business, um, you know, is not only the welfare to the animal, but the welfare to my employees. And, you know, being in my situation in a wheelchair, I can't afford for, for anybody to get hurt around me, you know, especially my wife Sarah. And so, you know, when it comes to operating these crushes, um, you know, they're as, they're as safe a crush as you'll ever, you'll ever work around. When I returned from the, the US uh, back in the Northern Territory, I started to look into how I was going to get one of these crushes uh, over to Australia and, and that basically led my involvement with the Katagra Group. Um, I got in touch with, with Cole Hammond and um, basically, you know, he, he took care of uh, bringing the crushes over and so we, you know, my father was looking at setting up some sort of hydraulic head bale and and I suggested he look into one of these crushes and he was a little bit reluctant as most old time cattlemen are, you know, to go into any form of new technology. But once we got the first crush out to Superjack, um, you know, he was sold within the first, you know, time he used the crush and, and, uh, and we've now got two out there. So I think that, you know, they speak for themselves. Each silencer crush is pre-ordered and custom built to suit your specific processing operation. Please tell us about your operation and we can discuss the different options available and suggest the features most suited. If you would like more information, please call or email us or alternatively speak with one of our reps. We're always happy to make arrangements for potential new clients who would like to view first-hand cattle being processed through a silencer crush. <laughs>